Hi, I'm Mike. I'm Scott. And I'm Mark. We are your Screen Machine product support team, and here's another quick tip. All right, so now that we have set the screen angle back here, uh, we want to move on to setting the angles on our side stackers that we've already got unfolded. So on this fine stacker here, we'll start with this one. So you should already know how to work the valve over there. Um, right now we're at our lowest setting. It's uh, 18 degrees. We've got it pinned in just like this. Uh, you'll only need to be working the valve section for the lower, lower section of this conveyor like we were doing earlier. So I've got Mark over on the valve, Scott on the opposite side because you've got a pin on this side and a pin on that side. So we'll go ahead and remove these pins at the lowest angle. Go ahead and move up to the second hole. So for the first hole, your, your uh, inner tube hole will be down at the bottom hole on the outer tube. For the second pin location, we'll be moving up to 21 degree angle. So your inner hole will be at the top uh, of this outer tube hole. Pin it just like that. Now we're at 21 degrees. We'll take that out. We'll go up to the next pin hole, which is 24 degrees. I'll have Mark take it up. All right, stop right there. So now we've got our, our inner tube uh, hole lined up with the lower hole on our outer tube. Go ahead and put your pin in there. Obviously, if you're leaving it there, there use the keeper. So we'll pull the pins out. We'll go all the way up. The, la the next and last pin joint is uh, 28 degrees. So stop right there. So on the inner tube here, you'll have your hole lined up with the top hole in the outer tube, the second hole in the inner tube. So go ahead and pin it like that. At this 28 degrees is your highest stockpile height. You'll get about 11 foot 10 inches out of your stockpile there at this highest setting. If you do use this highest setting, you really need to take into account your belt tension, uh, especially down by your chutes down here. So if you use this highest setting, you will need to, to loosen the tension on the belt or else you will uh, occur some belt damage. You'll see if you use this, how tight it gets uh, down on the chutes in this pocket here. So you'll need to just be be, atten be aware of that and pay close attention to how tight your belt is if you're using it at this highest angle. In another video, we'll show you how to tension and detension the belt as well. But um, so this this will we'll leave this at this angle and we'll head over to the uh, mids belt on the opposite side and do a similar thing there.